In the year 98, when our troubles was great, it was treason to be a militian. And the Black Whiskers said, though we'd never forget, though our history tells us there were Hessians. In these troublesome times, sure it was a great crime, and murder it never was viper. By the side of Glen Shee, not an acre from Meath, lived one Dinny Burdens, a piper. Neither wedding nor wake, it would be worth a shake, where Dinny was first not invited. For at squeezing the bags, or at emptying the kegs, he astonished as well as delighted. But in these times, poor Dinny, he could not earn a penny. Martial law had him stung like a viper, and they kept him within till the bones of his skin were grinning through the rags of the piper. One evening in June, as Dinny marched home, back from the fair at Rapangan, yet what should he see from the branch of a tree but the corpse of a Hessian there hanging? Says Dinny, these rogues, they've got boots, I've no brogues, so the boots he laid hold with a griper. And he pulled with such might, and the boots were so tight, legs, boots, and all came way with the piper. Now Dinny did run for fear of being hung till he came to Tim Tahiri's cabin. Ah, says Tim from within, sure I can't let you in, you'll be shot if you're caught out there rapping. So he went to the shed where the cow was in bed, with a wisp he began for to wipe her. And they lay down together in seven foot of feather, and the cow took to hugging the piper. Well, Dinny did yawn as day did dawn, and he peeled off the boots of the Hessian. And the legs be the law, sure he left in the straw, and he gave them leg bail for his mission. Now breakfast being done, Tim sent out his young son to get Dinny up like a lamp lighter. When the legs there he saw, he rose up like a jackdaw. Ah, oh, daddy, the cow's at the piper. Well, bad luck to the beast, it's got musical taste to eat such a beautiful chanter. A rapadrigavik, get a lump of a shtick, drive her off down the road and we'll canter. The neighbours were called, Mrs. Kennedy bawled, they began for to humbug and jiper. And in grandeur they met, and their whistles they wet, and like divils they danced round the piper. Well, the cow she was drove about a mile or two off, till they came to the fair at Timahaley, where there she was sold for four guineas in gold to the clerk of the parish, Tim Daly. They went to the tent where a penny was spent, the clerk being a jolly old swiper. And who would be there playing the rakes a kill there but me bowl Dinny Burdens, the piper. Well, Tim gave a bolt like a half-drunken colt, and he gazed at the piper like a gammock. Says he, be the powers, sure I thought for the last eight hours you were playing in the old cow's stomach. Well, Dinny observed that the Hessians were served, they began for the humbug and jiper. And in grandeur they met, and their whistles they wet, and like devils they danced round the piper.